Welcome back to AIPRM Tutorials. In this tutorial, I'm going to walk you through how to use the search bar. We've got over 3,500 prompts in the library and it is growing every single day. It is critical that you know how to find what you're looking for. In a past video, we actually already walked through how to look through topics, activities, sorting by popularity and usage, or even the model, especially if you are a ChatGPT Plus user. But what about this search bar over here? Okay, so say you're a small business owner. First off, the way you wanna think about it is a simple search. Use high level keyword terms because the search bar is gonna be searching through the prompt titles and the prompt descriptions. So in this example, small business owner, you want something business related because we do see prompts for things like coding or writing a book or things, you know, all sorts of ideas. So if I just type in business, let's take a look at some of the prompts that come up. Small uh, Twitter posts for small businesses, Facebook posts for small businesses, um, customized path to success, unlock your business's full potential with a customized roadmap. That is all over the place. Business marketing strategies, there are, well, there's 153 prompts for businesses. But what if I wanted something for a local business, right? So, you know, something with my Google business profile or something like that. I'm going to put in local, oh, fully local SEO. SEO local information for florists. Okay, that's very specific. Uh, 10 plug and play GMB posts. Steal your competitor's traffic. So you can get a sense of what you can do with the search bar. Say, for instance, I wanted to use an email prompt. Best email read before responding. Professional emails made easy. Email writer. Rate your outreach email. So good. So helpful. Use the search bar and make sure that if for whatever reason you can't find the prompt you're looking for, that you've actually cleared out after you use the search because it'll stay there until you remove it and it won't just reset on its own. That's it. If you run into any issues finding the prompt that you're looking for, remember you can always create your own. Our prompt engineers do it all the time. Check out our other tutorials on how to create a prompt. And if you have any questions, please head over to the AIPRM community forums. We're always welcoming of new faces. Ask us a question. We'll be happy to answer. Otherwise, check out the other AIPRM tutorials. Thanks for watching.